Pisces, and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, I think it's going to be a sunny day for you overall, most likely very professional. The moon is now moving into Sagittarius. That's a good thing. Wondering how you water signs did with that soul pyramid in water. That has broken today. Now, I myself were experiencing a lot more anguish than I was happiness. I had a lot of anger come up with the Mars stuff. I had a lot of Uranus, me getting fed up with things and emotionally really feeling it. But I'm an earth sign, and I'm not always accustomed to those crazy waves of water signs and emotion. So it might have calmed you, it might have riled you up. Let me know and comment about it. But today, regardless, things do change. The moon's moving into Sagittarius now, and it'll be there for the next two and a half days. For you, Pisces, that's kind of an emotional focus on professionalism and also a focus on your legacy. And this is a big topic. You just wrapped up a 12-year transit from Pluto last January on professionalism. So emotionally, I'm predicting you'll probably start to feel your new professionalism or feel your new legacy. That's part, I think, of the transit. But Jupiter is also kind of speaking today to most of the planets from what I can map out. We haven't talked about Jupiter in a while. Jupiter is an expansion planet. It's a teaching planet. It's a planet that basically brings in fortune so that you can learn and expand your mind. Sometimes the universe has got to bribe you. That's how I put it. So Jupiter is bribing you to change your politics. In fact, I would not be too surprised if you don't start thinking about politics today in this spacey day. There's a lot of Jupiter energy encouraging the expansion of thoughts and the expansion of where you happen to stand in a certain area of your life. So I'm putting money on the table that you'll feel professional, you'll be feeling your legacy, but your mind will be kind of pondering the expansion of your politics, and that also ties in to this month's transit which is the Sun in Taurus. Just so you know, we're still in Chapter 1, and Sun in Taurus is asking you to kind of expand your mind when it comes to the processes of your mind. This month we'll be talking about your prejudices, what you bring to the table, how you speak to yourself, all those sorts of things. So if you do have a conversation with yourself about your politics or profession, kind of think about how you think about it, because that's where the learning is. All right, Pisces, that's all I have for the day. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be.